Hello, I'm Sue Shapcott, and today I'm going to show you a drill that you can use if you have trouble switching between clubs when you're playing on the golf course. Okay, so when we learn golf, we usually learn with one or two clubs, we refine our swing, we get fairly consistent with one club, and then we go and play on the golf course and it's a whole different ball game. So not only are you switching clubs for every shot, but you have to adjust between irons and woods and then a short game shot. So it really puts you to the test and you figure out pretty fast that how you learned on the golf course is not the same as playing on the golf course. But the good news is there's ways to practice to help you develop the um, right skills to transition between clubs when you're out on the golf course. So for example, when we're practicing, we might hit 15, 20 shots with a seven iron, then we might hit another 15 or 20 shots with a five iron, and then we want the driver. Now, obviously that doesn't happen on the golf course. So we, we need to learn to adjust. And so I'm gonna show you a really simple drill that you can use when you're practicing um, I've just got two clubs with me here, but you can, um, you can use as many clubs as, as you would like um, as you get more competent at switching between them. And all that you're going to do is uh, start with, I've got my seven iron here and I've got a sand wedge here. So I'm going to start with just a couple of shots with my seven iron, which means that I'm going to be making a a regular swing with this club. Okay, that was one, felt pretty good. I'm gonna hit another. So I could just stay hitting shots like that and I would leave the range feeling pretty good that I was striking the ball well. But then when I go to the course, then I haven't really practiced in switching between clubs. So after a couple of shots, I'm just gonna switch out my seven iron and grab my sand wedge. And now I'm going to hit a couple of shots with my sand wedge. And I'm gonna give myself a target of about 40 yards so I had a practice swing just to try and get a feel for what the club is like, how far I want to hit it. Okay, that was a nice, nice shot. Kind of did what I wanted it to do. I'm going to do another one of those. Okay, so those shorter shots feel good great I'm not going to get too comfortable with those either and I'm going to switch right back to my seven iron take a swing just to get used to what I'm going to be doing and I'm going to hit a couple of shots with my seven iron again That wasn't too good, but it'll do. And then, you guessed it, I'm gonna switch back to my sand wedge and hit two more with that. That little practice swing. Feel the length of the club. Okay, one more. Okay, so you get the idea. So I'm switching between clubs. Now, even just with those eight shots that I hit, then I could feel that it was more challenging whenever I switched to a different club to hit a good shot. So I could have quite easily stayed and just hit a bunch of seven irons. I'd have left the range feeling pretty good, which, you know, alone that isn't a bad thing, 
but I wouldn't have worked on developing my skills um, to transition between clubs, which as you move from the range onto the golf course is really important and is going to help you score. Try that exercise at the range, see if it helps you prepare and transfer your skills from, from practice to play. Check out some of our other videos and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.